Hi everyone, my name is Lisa Wynn, and in the past few years I have done two 30-day instant ramen challenges, and out of those 60 plus instant ramen recipes, these are my top five. Coming in at number five, I have the sous vide ramen. Yes, I bagged up the instant ramen with an egg and some bok choy and somehow it worked. I enjoyed this one because I'm relatively new with using the precision cooker, so this was a fun experiment for me. Number four, I had the tamagoyaki inspired ramen. Although I had trouble flipping this thing, the end result was delicious. Sweet black bean ramen with egg and furikake. Can't go wrong with that. Number three would have to be the ramen steak spring roll. I roll a lot of stuff in rice paper, and this is one of my favorites. You can use any type of instant ramen or noodle, add some steak and greens, and call it a day. Naturally, I like to dip it in a spicy sauce. At number two, I have the herb crusted lamb. Before this, I had never cooked lamb before in my entire life, so successfully cooking it in a ramen dusted crust had me on cloud nine for quite a while. And for this one, I had to do it twice, but because I didn't have the lamb sauce the first day, or at least an edible one. Now down to number one, this one is my favorite because of how easy it is to make. It's decadent, it's delicious, and oh so good. It is the ramen grilled cheese sandwich. Butter up some toast, add whatever cheese you like, add the noodles, and boom, you're left with the masterpiece. Not only is it savory, but you get a good kick of spice as well, if you use spicy ramen. And there you have it, my top five instant ramen recipes that I've tried. I plan to do another one this year, so we'll see what I come up with. Thanks for watching.